Now I look out the window at the guy across the street. Now I have lived here for ages, but we just never meet. Now our first interaction is happening at last, across a desolate street behind two panes of glass. I stand there for a moment, he stands looking back, to the point it gets awkward like cue idle chit chat. But I just look at him and he looks at me, two people remembering what it was to be free. And then he turns away, so I retire to my bed. And I wonder if the same bad news fills his head. I lie awake on my back. It's never this hot. I look at the clock on the wall a lot. It's not still Tuesday. It is. We'll be fine. As long as no one else tells me it's an unprecedented time. Like we get it. Bit of face time. Beer and wine. You heard of climbing the walls? Well, I'm abseiling mine. <clears throat> I wake up the next morning for no real reason, like this furlough means nothing, they're not going to pay you this season. So still in my pants, I grab a bowl and a spoon, and for breakfast I have lasagna like it's late afternoon. Like why not? I go over to the window, I look out at the rain, and the same bloke from yesterday is doing exactly the same. Now we are both in our pants. So I feel like it's time to be brave. So I give him a patriotic, non-committal wave. Not sure if it's landed, he's still standing still. One hand now resting on the windowsill. Maybe it's the delay. I've got so used to Zoom. And then I get it, a thumbs up from the opposite room. I give him one back. I nod my head as if to say, like, go and enjoy the rest of your isolation day. Because it sucks, and it does, but like I'm an extrovert at heart. I need people to laugh and smile for a start. So as the days progress, I start seeing Jeff more. That's Jeff, by the way, I've named him. We're interacting in a way like we never would before. He plays his guitar, we play virtual tag. He laughs when I do the escalator gag. Like, what a bloke. You know, who would have thought it? So this horrendous situation that was so unexpected has bridged the smallest of gaps and made me and Jeff more connected. So as dark as it gets, bring some light to your day. Do something different in a unprecedented way. Because when I can't carry on, I get a glimmer of hope across a desolate street from our half-naked bloke.